Hi Chennai Times, uh, I'm really happy uh, to meet you all at this moment of uh, my film being going to release, Tadam. So, Rambo Sandosham and um, March it's going to release. Uh, so, it's going to be the next film after Chekka Chavandavanam. Really excited. Chekacha Vandavanam is a very unexpected uh, film uh, because I least expected Mani sir calling me uh, uh, for the for his, uh, that film particularly because um, I used to real I'm a huge huge fan of Mani sir and I my dream to work with him and all that is, was there and after a point I said okay fine I think that's that's it because he was like uh, doing there was there were there weren't really scope. For my, if uh, for me in the, the the type of films he did and all that stuff, so I said okay, fine, he yes. hasn't. So because I went uh, when uh, Alai Pai Day was uh, happening and I had seen him. That's the last time I saw him and first time I saw him. And after that I said okay, fine. And because he said when the when the time comes, I'll tell you around with the right script. I'll let you know. But I didn't know it'll come uh, uh, this time. So but uh, it was it just took me into surprise and I went and heard the script and I was just sitting down, looking at Mani sir, narrating the whole script and uh, I was just thinking whether I am dreaming or I am just sitting in front of Mani sir and he gave me a choice, Arun, uh, if you just think about it, if you want to do it, you can. I was like just wondering what to think about it and I said, sir, I am doing it. So, that is the only thing and and started off like that and it was uh, one beautiful experience. So, I think working with him. Uh, was a big time learning experience for me. Each and every day, uh, there was something um, uh, taken back home from the sets. Uh, the energy he transformed to each and every character, and that's what you saw uh, there in the film. And the way he explains, he doesn't um, actually narrate the, uh, you know, read the dialogues and tell you. The way he comes and explains the situation where you're going to you know, tell this dialogue and the the feel of it, I think is the best and he just comes and just sits to you next to you and he just explains and just gives few pointers here and there, automatically you will start performing and it was wonderful working with him and I think he, this was a, uh, still I am not out of it because I just uh, cherish each and every moment uh, during the shoot, being it uh, all the legends were there, uh, Rahman sir was my dream, um, of course I uh, wanted to start my career with him and that's that's what I uh, that's how I came in because it's Rahman's music I uh, said yes to the project and that delayed and that didn't happen and that was a big disappointment in my thing because if that would have been my start yeah my debut so it was with uh, Rahman so that's how it started all, all, all started and uh, that's how I said yes to my first debut film and that didn't happen and suddenly they said no we'll start another one and that will you know parallel we'll do that and that didn't happen as a big huge disappointment for me but again, 25th film, Mani Ratnam, Rahman sir, I think I couldn't have asked for more. Uh, so, I thank uh, God for giving this opportunity and you know this, uh, I think it was at the right time of my uh, career and uh, I made the maximum use of it. Um, I think I gave my best uh, because it's a multi-starer again. So, working with uh, so many stars was a huge experience and I think uh, when uh, you give your best when you act with good actors. So. In that way, uh, I was very comfortable because I've already uh, done a uh, film with Ajit sir and even it's uh, a huge star. So, I was not, uh, so we knew our paths, even Sembu or uh, Arvind Sam is already, Arvind Sam now is like, he already has done so many films. I think myself and uh, my, Sembu and myself were the only per people were like fresh because Vijay Sethi uh, joined us very late. So, we were the one who was little, for the first two days, couple of days, we were like little, you know, uh, um, uh, wondering what's happening and all that stuff. But then we settled down and Manizar was like so sweet, uh, whatever you go, just like a child, even like a, like a newcomer, I used to go and ask him and he used to explain and he said, uh, no, yeah, because I was like wondering whether to talk, I was like, how to talk to Manizar, uh, will, will it be okay and all that stuff, then 
Arun Samana told me that he will be the first person to tell you, he will love when you ask questions, just go and ask him. And I, then that is how I, all the interaction started and uh, he just uh, gave me that space and uh, he never restricted uh, any actor because we knew our limits and we knew that we are, going to, we are doing a money search film. So we adapt uh, towards any actor, I think uh, a good actor will adapt to the director's uh, thing. So and he didn't restrict anyone, see if you see Sembo, he was like himself. He didn't uh, let him, uh, you know, try to change his style or something. He let everyone, even Vijay said, he let him do his thing. So that was something nice for, for a director in that uh, stage. He, he wanted that in this film. And I think uh, that was one film that I cannot forget. And the BGM um, Rahman gave for me was like amazing. And uh, Hayati was one of the, my best, uh, till date best track which I've got. So I think uh, I'm blessed that I've uh, done the film and uh, should take it uh, forward from here on. Hope so, I don't know, <laughs> I am looking forward. If he calls me, I would uh, love to do it again. Okay. So we have uh, been hearing about Adam and all uh, the formation back with your uh, favorite director and all that and we also know that you are playing a dual role. So you tell us what is going to talk about the project, what, what should one do in form when they come to this movie? Yeah, Tadam as such, uh, when I heard the script, it really excited me as an audience. Um, it has got a very strong uh, screenplay and uh, the storyline itself is uh, something different. Um, it has got a lot of layers in the film. Uh, it's got a uh, lot of emotions, there's romance and uh, there is an individual connector between um, with the parents, how uh, they uh, uh, after they leave, uh, how it's going to affect uh, um, uh, the uh, uh, kids. Now that's uh, a lot of uh, emotions in involved, and the way he has uh, uh, taken the script from the start till the end, the last frame. I think that's going to uh, be uh, the, the curiosity level is going to increase from the beginning till the end, till the last frame. So that's what excited me, and uh, I didn't know it's going to be a, a it is a dual role till I heard the script because Magar sir didn't tell me that it's going to be a dual it's a dual role in the beginning. So once I started listening to the script, then it, it excited me more and uh, things went on. So already I have a good rapport with uh, Magar sir as Tadaira uh, Taka was my one of my uh, best films in my career, and I have a lot of confidence in him, and. Uh, Generally, I surrender myself to Magar in this film, that's what I did. Uh, so, whatever he wanted, I just uh, gave my 10%. And uh, he's very clear on what he wants and as a director. And uh, I think somewhere down the lane, we have a good wavelength in between us. So, even if we give a shot and uh, it's late in the night, 3.30 in the night, and uh, I'll just look, turn and look at him after the shot. He will just give a slightest of reaction, uh, yeah Arun, okay, but I could understand that he needs another trick. So I will say, sir, can I give another one? It's okay. No, Arun, it's, is it okay for you? I said, no, no problem, sir, because it's late in the night, you know the actors, how tired we are. But um, then though I know that he needs something. So he's a person like he waits for that, that moment and even the smallest uh, reactions he captures. And, and that uh, was wonderful working with uh, Magar. And, that's what excited me. Um, the whole screenplay script excited me a lot. Okay. Is it, I mean, are you making your bets on uh, thrillers because that's been working for you back to back if you had Nadia and Dakar and you can do any work for you and this is also uh, to be a thriller. Yeah, so, I mean. See, I didn't uh, go in for it. The um, scripts came in and um, I didn't think it's going to be a thriller when Magir came up. Uh, so. It turned out to be a thriller again, a suspense, uh, investigative thriller. Um, but somewhat, I don't know, but, but it's not like I'm planning to do it. It just happened because the scripts were nice. Uh, that's how I uh, picked up and did it. Let's not break the winning streak. And I thought maybe that works and people uh, like uh, what I do. So I thought uh, maybe why not? I didn't push it away. I thought I'll let me take it and do it because this is one of the interesting scripts which um, in my career. So I thought why not let's do it. Okay, but do you think thriller works 
Not exactly, yeah, of course, but now with the one which I'm doing next, uh, Boxer, and I'm doing a film, it's actually completely a sports based film. And it's uh, a lot of patriotism and uh, uh, the characterization itself is like amazing. Um, so I really loved the way he, uh, the, uh, the characterization was. Uh, so I thought, why, why don't, why not uh, do it? So that's completely a different one. And again, Agni Chiragal is an action thriller. It's an action film. It's not a thriller. It's an action film. So. I'm branching out as well, but uh, fortunately, I'm uh, getting back-to-back -back, um, uh, thrillers now. And uh, I think people also um, like to be hooked on to the seat till the end and they want to watch something. Uh, and this, uh, it should be a good uh, script, you know, uh, to give a thriller. It should be a good script and the screenplay should be nice. And everything gelled well in this film too, so that's why I took it up. Basically, he wanted someone really fresh for uh, Tanya's role, the one character she's like, uh, she's playing one of the leads and Smriti is another character, uh, she's another lead uh, for an, uh, another pair. There's two lovely romantic tracks in the film, um, which he thought like, um, uh, only if a fresh face uh, does it, it'll look good. And we, he was like in search for it for more than uh, three months and uh, finally we, uh, uh, narrowed down to uh, Tanya and Smriti and of course uh, Vidya Pradeep is uh, playing a very crucial role in the film and she plays the investigative uh, officer in the film. So I think um, when you see the film, uh, audience will connect with the characters in each and every character and Magasar like has his own vision and uh, I think this the, maybe if someone else would have played I don't know if it would have uh, fit uh, fitted into the character but being a newcomer so I think uh, they've uh, done their roles really well I think they're very promising uh, um, actors as well so it's nice to you know uh, introduce someone and it's nice to uh, see that uh, people would receive it well also what, what 13 takes is a, a big bogus, so please don't uh, uh, think about it. It's muggers, like just pulling my leg. Um, of course, yeah, he convinced me to do a, um, uh, the scene. I was like little hesitant about it when he uh, said that Arun, this needs a scene like that. And I said, uh, sir, is it, is it necessary because I'm not uh, very comfortable, so let's not do it. He said, Arun, you're an actor and this film needs it. And he explained me that... Uh, I think in the film you'll know uh, why it's uh, and a very important and he's a kind of a director who doesn't uh, show uh, even if it is a um, romance scene or if in nothing uh, where you would feel you know oh, awkward or something and he's very very poetic and is a wonderful uh, presenter so in that way um, it is wonderful uh, um, working in all the romantic scenes you know it is like for me it was something different because I was very, very, uh, 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 I'll stay away from all this romance first. In the beginning, I was very, I not very comfortable. And after Thadaira Thaka, he actually made me, I think uh, with me and Mamta chemistry was really, worked out really well. And after that, I felt he, I think this film, uh, he'll explore uh, more of that side of me and uh, because the film needed it. So, he convinced me and I did it and uh, that's about it. I think when you see in the film, it's, it's not going to be <laughs> uh, what you expect and uh, it's very, very uh, lovely, it's very cute and uh, I think that's what uh, will connect the audience. Yeah. It's not that, uh, it's the f uh, script should excite me. And as I said, uh, I don't, uh, I'm not insecure uh, as an actor because um, through these years I've learnt a lot and uh, I know my uh, capability and I'm confident on what I'm going to deliver. And it's just the thing that uh, how well this character is going to connect with the audience. That's what I uh, 
see when I listen to a script. And uh, again, Admit Chiragal, the film uh, me and Vijayantnya uh, doing, uh, is uh, another action flick with uh, Motor Podam Naveen. And that's, uh, he is very talented and he has a different vision. Then I thought, okay, uh, let's give it a shot. And it's going to be a different film for me as well. So I'm just trying to um, explore in different areas. And uh, I think uh, directors like these, you know, I just want to. Uh, but I think good directors like him, like uh, different directors will explore different kind of uh, thing from an actor. So I just want to uh, do films like that. So uh, I think it's one of the interesting, so it's not like I'll be doing only uh, multi-starter or um, solo films. This, the, the script should excite me okay. and the character should connect with the audience. But can you see you in uh, taking up? I don't know. As I said, um, after NAR Indal, I had got a lot of offers from uh, big companies and uh, opposite to big stars. Um, but I wasn't into The script didn't excite me. Uh, and my character, I didn't want to play a normal uh, antagonist in a film. Uh, it should create an impact. So in that way, if something comes up like Victor, I would take it up. Uh, but it should excite me and uh, it, it should be challenging and if something uh, that sort of comes up and I, I will take it um, there's no uh, second thought about it because the audience are very clear around um, they don't uh, see it as low he's a protagonist he's an antagonist or it's the how uh, we connect <coughs> with them and um, how well we play it it, it should be likable and they should love that character and that's what uh, they think and they appreciate the good work what we do so i think in that uh, way it's just like hollywood like how the uh, actors do like um, all of them they play a negative uh, shade in one film and the next film they are the lead so it's like that so actors don't have boundaries and don't restrict i, I think we shouldn't restrict ourselves but in one way i'm really happy that uh, both the sides have been received very well so uh, one thing is that uh, I am unpredictable in a film, so anything, anywhere can happen. So that's one positive thing which I have uh, got in my, uh, there's an image which I have uh, which slowly built up. So I think that's uh, one thing which is nice which has happened. No, uh, it's wonderful uh, um, to be a part of Saho because um, I think Prabhas is a next big venture after Bahubali. I think um, I'm really lucky to be a part of uh, the film as well. And my character is a, it's a very crucial uh, character. Uh, I can't say more about it because uh, there's a lot of characters in the film uh, and it is wonderful working with uh, um, legends like... Uh, Jackie Shroff sir, Lal sir, and uh, we have uh, Mandra Bedi, we have uh, a lot of uh, Neil Nathan, and uh, I think it's that's my this is this film is my first debut in Hindi as well because it's the first time I've uh, uh, given lines in Hindi as well. And oh, uh, no, actually we we shot it in Hindi, oh. Telugu, and Tamil will be a dubbing. Uh, so we we've, we've been shooting it from both languages. It is quite interesting because I like something, uh, something new, you know. So I am, I'm not very familiar with Hindi, and uh, the first uh, the the efforts I put in. Uh, the next day when I uh, had a scene with Mantra Bedi, I uh, gave my lines and I uh, stood there and we were taking Telugu and she came up close. Uh, you said you don't know Hindi, right? Yes, ma'am. But you speak so fluently. No ma'am, I just <laughs> memorized it and I wanted to get it right and get the diction right because we should, whatever we do, we should do it with, uh, um, with, sense, with sincerity and I thought I'll give my best there. Um, so I said, okay, fine. Uh, um, getting a compliment from her, uh, from an Hindi star is something nice. Uh, but the way the film has shaped up is uh, really nice. It's going to be a, yeah. I have another day left, um, I'm almost done. I just have one day of uh, work left. I think it will be done March or some, 
sort. But already they have fixed the release August uh, 15th. Uh, really excited uh, with um, debuting in Hindi in such a huge film. So I'm just looking forward. So this is my second film in Telugu. And uh, now, as as it is, Agni Chirugal has been uh, uh, done in two languages as well. It's uh, been uh, uh, shot in Telugu as Juala. Uh, so it's nice. But right now, no. Uh, <laughs> maybe uh, if, because Anurag sir has done done it there, and some maybe uh, directors like that come up and you know uh, start up, and maybe why not uh, do it like that? But right now, I don't have any idea. Okay. So as an actor, uh, I mean, how do you approach See, I don't want to restrict myself to a certain genres, as I said. But yes, of course, I know my strength. Um, action is my strength, and uh, um, but I want to explore different areas as well. Um, so, uh, as I said, if I have an, an interesting script and if I feel that it really excites me and it will excite the audience, I'm ready to do it, uh, no matter what genre is it. Uh, so in that way, I'm just exploring, uh, and there's a lot of things to be explored in, as an actor in me as well. Like. Uh, so as I said, uh, see, Kutram 23 was one uh, phase of uh, me, uh, which I haven't done a cop role. And there's a lot of, so many roles which I haven't played yet. I'm just take, trying to take it one by one as it comes. I don't plan. Uh, no, I'm going to do a superhero script. No, I'm going to do a out and out uh, in a horror film. Nothing like that in my mind. I, as, as of course, I wanted to do an uh, historical film. Uh, if I have the chance, I would love to do it. Uh, so things are like that. So there's a lot of things which I uh, wanted to uh, take up and do. So still I have that time. So I'm very very uh, cautious in selecting my script. That's the delay which which is happening in because uh, every year I I make it a point. Okay, this year I'm doing two films at least. You know, my there should be at least two two releases. But somehow it's like uh, getting delayed. Uh, I'm taking that time because after Chekka Chowdhury, one five six months, I'm I was just listening to scripts. I didn't start shooting. I was just uh, narrowing down the script which I'm going to do. So I was just planning uh, my uh, next uh, couple of films. So that's that takes time, but uh, that doesn't matter because uh, audience that gap. If you give a good film, that gap would be filled. That's what I think as an actor. And how do you handle trolls? Trolls? <laughs> do you them? Not exactly. Certain, yeah, of course, my friends forward or some something which comes directly or things like that. As an actor, of course, yeah, we, uh, we have to face them um, in a positive uh, attitude, that's it. So, um, if it is a uh, um, thing which has to be changed, we can. Uh, and if it's just, uh, uh, I think you just ignore a few things. If you think it's not, uh, yeah, we just ignore it. Uh, thanks China Times, um, thanks for watching this interview, I am really happy uh, to meet you all uh, through China Times here and um, Tadam is coming up March, so please do watch it in theatres, I am sure it will excite you all, mm, it is uh, one film uh, that you should not miss because uh, there are a lot of surprises in the film, um, I think um, Magir and me are the combo, is, uh, besides that there is a lot more surprises in the film. Uh, yes, of course, you have Yogi Babu, it's a, it's a thorough entertainer, but I think uh, once you come out from the uh, theatres, you will take back a lot of uh, um, memories and uh, you will have a, 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 a heavy heart when you come out. So I am uh, sure you love the film, so please do watch and support me as always. Uh, uh, through all my films you have been supporting from Tadayra Taka, Yana Irindal, um, Chaka Chama the Vana Man, Kutram 23. I am really happy uh, that uh, this year, this is going to be my first film uh, release. This uh, uh, Tadam is going to be my first release this year. So I am really uh, looking forward to see you all in theatres. Bye bye.